Hey guys, it's Obtube one here, and today I'm going to show you how to make a watermark. So what you want to do first is open your Adobe Fireworks or Photoshop. Mine's already open. Once you've got that open, just click on Create New Fireworks Document. Once you've done that, you want to change the width to 100 and change the height to 100 and leave the resolution at 72 and make sure that it's on pixels pixels and pixels slash inch okay for you guys for the canvas color it should say white um, if it is change that change that to transparent and just click OK okay the first thing you want to do is make the circle go to the left side go to the victor size and just click on the rectangle tool which isn't actually the rectangle tool it has many other kinds of tools um, and you want to click the ellipse tool which is basically um, a circle once you've done that just make your circle and um, just center it once you've made it okay so that's center as you can see um, the inside of it is white um, you can go to the style section over here on the right and um, go to one of these chrome styles or any other kind of styles textiles and stuff like that and uh, just click one of them and uh, the inside of it will get filled like that and it will add an effect or you, if you want to make your own just clear that and uh, if you just want to make an effect pick a color I'm going to pick red um, you can pick any color you want and um, over here um, it says solid just change that into gradient and you can pick any of these I'm just going to pick linear and go back to the color section again um, I recommend you make the left side lighter than the right side so I'm going to pick red and um, a little bit darker color red just like that and um, if you want to make a border for your watermark go to the right side over here just this little square where it has that white box with a red line across it just click on that and choose any color I'm going to pick black and it makes a thin little, little um, border around your circle uh, just change it to a 2 or 3 or a 4 to make it a little thick. I'm going to pick 4. And it makes it a little bit more thicker. Actually, I'm going to pick 5. That's if you want a border. So uh, that's how you do it. Just change that back to 5. This isn't going to be mine. This is just an example. So um, once you've made that, click on your text tool. and uh, just um, in the center of it make a little box and write in what you want to write I'm just going to write YT1 so there it is and um, you can change the color of it if you want um, I'm just going to just going to double click on it and highlight it to uh, change the color so if you want to change the color you can come over here to this little box again and just change the color to anything let's try blue yeah that's alright or if um, you don't you want um, something pretty cool like it's a uh, style you go back to the style section you go to uh, um, text web styles and you can click one of these 
Um, the text corporate styles are a little better. So I'm going to pick this one over here. Yeah, and uh, just center that into the circle. Okay, so once you like it and you think it looks pretty good, I'm just center this. Okay, that's sort of in the center. Okay, if you like it and you think it looks good, yeah, it, once you liked it and everything, uh, just click on File, Save As, and uh, I'm just going to save it as Example, and make sure you save it as Fireworks PNG, none of the other ones, not uh, BMP, JPEG, or SWF or anything like that, just just leave it as PNG and uh, save it somewhere you'll find it again and I'm going to save mine to my desktop and just click save alright once you've saved it you can X out of uh, fireworks um, I'm going to right click on mine, I'm going to open with um, Windows um, Live Full Gallery and um, once you open it, over there should be your watermark. So um, that's how you make a watermark using Adobe Fireworks. You can use this also on Adobe Photoshop. And yeah, so thanks guys for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe.